the Great Western Engine puffed sadly to Edward Station. It's not fair. Diesel has been telling lies about me and made the fat controller and all the engines think I'm horrid. I know you aren't, and so does the fat controller. You wait and see. Why don't you help me with these trucks? Duck felt happier with Edward and set to work at once. The two engines have to work hard pushing and pulling all afternoon. At last, they reach the top of the hill, Doc whistled goodbye and rolled gently over the crossing to the other line. Duck loved coasting down the hill, running easily with the wind whistling past. Suddenly, it was a guard's warning whistle. Hurrah, hurrah, hurrah. We've broken away, we've broken away. Chase him, bump him, throw him off the rails. Hurry, duck. Hurry. They raced through Edwards Station, but the trucks were catching up. As fast as we can, then they'll catch us gradually. Another clear mile and we'll do it. Oh, glory, look at that. James was just pulling out on their line through the station ahead any minute. There could be a crash. It's up to you now, duck. Duck put every ounce of weight and steam against the trucks. It's too late. Duck shut his eyes as he veered into a siding where a barber had set up shop. He was shaving a customer. The silly trucks had knocked their guard off his van and left him far behind after he had whistled a warning. But the trucks didn't care. They were feeling very pleased with themselves. Beg pardon, sir. Excuse my intrusion. No, I won't. You frightened my customers. I'll teach you. Thomas was helping to pull the trucks away when the fat controller arrived. I do not like engines popping through my walls. I appreciate your feelings. But you must know that this engine and his crew have prevented a serious accident. It was a very close up. Shave. Oh. Oh. Excuse me. I'm sorry. I didn't know you were being a brave engine. That's alright, sir. I didn't know that either. You were very brave indeed. I'm proud of you. The Fat Controller watched the rescue operation. Then he had more news for Duck. And when you are properly washed and mended, you are coming home. Home, sir? Do you mean the yard? Of course. But, sir, they don't like me. They like Diesel. Not now. I never believed Diesel, so I sent him packing. The engines were sorry and want you back. A few days later, when he came home, there was a really rousing welcome for Duck the Great Western Engine. That's a happy ending, Starlight. Well done. So, what happened to Diesel then? Well... Oh, 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 Devious Diesel. How dare you told lies to the trucks about Duck, and made Gordon, James, and Henry accused him for that. This is one of the worst things you've ever done. I thought you've changed your ways, but no. Instead of grounding you, we'll send you packing. No 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 no. Please don't send me packing. I'm very sorry for getting back into trouble. I promise not to do it again. Too bad diesel. Arya Sonata send this smelly black weasel to his mommy. You can't do this to me. 
I go to a yard and improve it. I'm revolutionary. Do you know who I am? I'm the...